Eleven, eleven, eleven with Jenna. Up at the ranch with the wild flowers. Up at the ranch with the wild flowers. Just doing a quick check in. It is um, the day after the day after the day after that. Here on eleven, eleven with Jenna. And yes, those are all wildflowers. There's so many different colors. Hello, Michael Bartoloni. There's this, they're going to sleep for the night, but there's yellow and purple and then other purple. And it's incredible what's out here. I just wanted to say hi and show you what it looks like. Hey, William D. Lindemann. Thanks for being there earlier. I knew it was muffled. Um, my earbuds were in my pocket. <laughs> they were in my pocket. Yeah. It's really something. And these purple ones are from a photo that I took. The, the, they're the flowers I took a photo of Lillian last year. In the wild flowers. But it's just getting dark, and I thought, if I get out there soon enough, I can show these remarkable little purple flowers. They're teeny tiny. They're teeny tiny. Look, that's how tiny they are. Yeah, it's pretty incredible. Mama Grace with the beautiful face and looking at wildflowers out here in the front area. And then there's, look at all the yellow over here. I took photos of Lillian in the flowers. Good night, Michael. Thanks for rolling by. There are a lot of gophers out here, so you have to be super careful. But look at this bed of beautiful. Yep. See, they're all asleep now. They're asleep. In the morning, their faces face the other way. Yep. I guess you could walk out with me while I take the trash. I didn't put the trash in the right spot. I learned that I need to put it a little bit further down the road. So that's what I'm about to do. Hello. My name is Jenna. This is 1111 with Jenna. I'm here seven days, seven nights, 14 times a week. Even if it's just us, little old us, hanging out here. I'll, you can walk with me out to the trash, and then I probably will stay. Good night. I made a no meat meatloaf tonight, but I forgot the walnuts. I put lentils in and potatoes, sweet potato, lentils, mushrooms, onions, yellow pepper. I forgot the walnuts. How could I forget the walnuts? I forgot them. But it's still really good. Mama, if you want some, you can have it your way. The mo the the no meat meatloaf. Here's it's really pretty. There's a couple of mountains up yonder. There's still a little bit of snow on them over down by the, well, you can't see it from their house. You can see it maybe from the road. This is exciting, isn't it? Taking the trash out. Hey. <laughs> But it's a beautiful night. The animals are all starting to make some make some noise. I'm about to make some noise with the cans. Okay, let's see. Yeah, see there there's some hills over there that still have some white on them. And what I learned when I lived over that way is 
you don't plant your tomatoes until that particular snow has melted. So it's not time, but here we go. Okay, there's one. Now, this is, this is how exciting 11.11 can be. I think tomorrow morning, well, depending on when it does get warm, Garabato's going to get a bath. I thought about that for tomorrow, but I don't think it's going to be warm enough as of this moment. But here we are. Yeah, girl, get it. Always good to, when you eat whatever you eat, whatever meal it is, go walk afterwards. I just had my no meat meatloaf. Ooh, there's a planets and stars. Oh my. Hey, Pat. Hi, Pat Moriarty. What's up? Yes, I made no meat meatloaf and I forgot the walnuts. So I got to do it again. I'll, I'll make some more. I'm going to get some better, more mushrooms. More shrooms. Always good to have more shrooms. And then, like, oh, that's what I was saying. Good to walk after you eat. Looks like you're in a nice place. I am. I'm up at the ranch. And there's, this is where the wildflowers are. Go away That's where the wildflowers are. Where the wildflowers are. Maybe if I get up tomorrow morning and it was so hard today. I was ready to, I was up and then I went to the bathroom and I was doing stuff cause you know, I was unpacking some things. And I went in my room and Lillian was all snug in bed. And I thought, I'm going to do 11-11 from bed with Lillian Pearl. So I went back to bed. It was so great. And now she's running around. And I think we're going to watch a movie. Got some things done today. So we'll watch a movie. How about you? Are you working on those characters still, Pat? I'd love to see them. Can't wait. So proud of you. So excited for you. William D. It's 1130 at night. Do you work tomorrow? Probably going to sleep soon. Thanks, you guys, for being here. Thanks for rolling by. It is much lighter out there than it is under this hood. So just a few weeks ago... A little over a month ago, all this was covered with snow, and now it's covered with wildflowers. And the crickets are starting, and the frogs are starting. About 11.30, it's a symphony. I hear a symphony. It's true. All right, kids. Well, I'm going to say have a beautiful evening. I think... I'm in the middle of 1111 steps, which is a good thing. Oh, good, good. Okay, well, I'm glad you're done with that and Patrick is getting a much honored send off. More of one, that's beautiful. Gracie, I'm gonna make you some broth, ginger and vegetables, broth. And perhaps tomorrow morning we'll see wildflowers and horses taking a bath. Maybe. Y'all have a beautiful night. Stay safe, stay healthy, and be real nice. And come on back here 
Come on back here once or twice. Stay safe, stay healthy, be real nice. And I will see you, I'll be here twice as nice. Yes, I will be here, I am here twice as nice. There he is, Garabato. Hi. Hi there. Hi there. You're so handsome. You're just a good boy. You're a good boy. Yay. Hi. I'm not going to follow you. I just wanted to say hello and good night. See you in the morning time. 11 minutes and 11 seconds. There we go. Love hard, everybody. Right, Garabato? Real hard. See ya. And good night.